comparison. Now, let me guarantee you, let me promise you, let me absolutely uh, guarantee that you, if you're a guest, you will not be asked to speak. It's okay. Calm down. Just, <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I remember the first time, in fact, I remember the first time my wife came. And the last time, <laughs> she sat in the front row, and there were two Breedas, her name is Breeda. And Breeda, the first Breeda, was um, an, well, she was in her later years, and she was given a topic. So the topic was, and Breeda. But Breeda took a while to get out of the chair. <laughs> so my Breeda thought it was her. <laughs> It was way if it could have been. She couldn't even speak. It's okay. You will not be asked to speak. Okay? Now, then, followed by that, we will have three uh, speeches, three prepared speeches. And I'll tell you about that beforehand. Then we'll have a break, and then we'll have the evaluations. Now, if you look at this, the, the, if you have seen the agenda, you will see evaluations. That's a very important part of Toastmasters, because the reason we're here, and I think it's a really lovely mission statement, um, and I'd just like to read it for you. The mission of a Toastmaster club is to provide a mutually supportive and positive learning environment in which every individual member has the opportunity to develop oral communication and leadership skills, which in turn foster self-confidence and personal growth. Now, that's not about, we're not back to school, but the thing about it is, is that we're here in an environment where everybody wants to learn, and the only way to learn is to get some feedback, to get some evaluation. So, we're going to have a break, and then after the break, the speeches are going to be evaluated by certain people on the, on the, on the agenda. Okay? So that's how it's going to be. Don't worry about it. Sit back, relax. You're not going to be asked the topic, but some other people are, and Joe Staunton is going to take the floor. Joe.